Gary! Gary! Oh, hi guys. I can't find Gary anywhere. Can you help me? Alright, after three, we'll shout Gary's name. One, two, three. Gary! No, I, I, I don't know where he is. We've got to be a bit louder, guys. Come on. One, two, three. Gary! I'm so angry! Oh, Gary, what's the matter? Well, I was trying to build a, ta a tower out of playing cards, but it kept falling over. I'm, I'm sure you can do it, Gary. you just got to believe in yourself. Is there a story about that? There is, actually, one of Daniel, oh. about how you, having to stand firm. Brilliant! Let's hear it. Okay. King Nebuchadnezzar had a huge statue of gold and made it a law that everyone should worship it. He said, If you do not worship my statue, then you'll be thrown into a blazing fire. <gasps> oh no! So the people did, but Daniel and his friends didn't. They knew it was wrong to worship the statue and only worship God. When the king found out, he was furious and ordered them to come to the palace right away. The king said, Is it true you are not worshipping the statue? Daniel and his friends said, Yes. Then the king said, Then you must be thrown into the blazing fire. No one can save you now. Oh no! Poor Daniel! Did anyone save him and his friends? Well, Daniel said, If we are thrown into the fire, our God will save us. We will worship no other God than our own. So they were thrown into the fire, and it was so hot that it killed the surrounding guards. However, Daniel and his friends came out without a single mark on them. God had saved them. The king was so surprised that he started worshipping God. Daniel and his friends stood firm for what they believed in. They knew God would protect them. Oh wow, that's amazing. You know what? I'm going to go home and have another go at doing my pyramid of cards. I'll see you tomorrow. Bye! Bye.